Well guys, the last time you've seen this van, we had just finished the tires. A lot has been done to this. It's probably been about two and a half months since I've made a video about this van. I did not paint this. I sent this out to be painted and it took almost a month. It's not the best paint job. So it's still a little, a little wet. It's been sitting here in the sun for three days trying to clear up, but it's getting there. So what we have going on here today just gonna do a quick little walk around of the color we chose. We chose a sand color with a white roof. And I think it's looking pretty good. It's a $1,500 paint job. It's what do you expect for 1,500 bucks. Coming on the inside, we've done a lot on the inside here. We have seat co uh, covers, so that way I don't get them dirty. Uh, we haven't done anything else to the electrical, but we really haven't had to. We got the bus painted! Holy Mackinac. Lots of stuff being done in here. We just put the bed in here today. It apparently needs 24 hours to fully expand. We got curtain rods up. I'm a little nervous on the noise that these things will make. We got this thing up. Uh, what else do we have? Got the gas all hooked up. We got the solar panel. Sorry, the, the solar system still working. We got the couch in it. We got everything in it. This thing is starting to look better and better every day. We got the fridge working. We just have to hook up the propane again. Um, got the toilet mounted. I don't know if I did a video with this in it. But we have a mirror. It does lock in place too, but we're just gonna slide it out of the way. Locks in place in there. But lots of stuff's being done to this. I'm extremely happy with how this thing is turning out. Uh, the build videos have kind of been a little sporadic and I'm sorry about that, but I got so much stuff on the go. But extremely happy with the color, extremely happy with everything's going together. Outside, the color that Tabitha picked is sweet. It's, it's actually a really nice color. Uh, it could have been done better, but you know what? It's because I cut corners and I chose a cheaper paint job than anything else. So the paint job is looking good. What we're doing today is we're just going around it and fixing up some of the uh, bad paint marks and stuff like that. I have the solar panel out on the roof of my Tacoma. Just letting it heat up so it's a little bit more pliable and then we'll stick it to the roof of this thing and uh, go from there. But uh, you know what guys, I'm very happy with how this thing is coming. Um, the school bus trip is less than 40 days away now. So, I'm pretty happy about that and I know I've skipped a lot but honestly guys it's really been hard to film this. I've got so little time to actually work on it that it's just kind of been sporadic and stuff but it's coming along. The color's been good, the propane system is done, I got the tank all tucked away underneath here. Uh, the tank goes right in this little metal cabinet I built underneath here. We got the tires on there, I'm trying to get away from the radio. but. Uh, yeah, I'm very happy with how this is going. We just got a couple curtains to mount now, and uh, we got our first trip in less than two weeks, and that is a three-day little camping adventure with this thing, so where we can try to find some bugs and work some things out and go from there, but quite a bit's being done to it. I don't know. Is there anything you guys want to know about it? Leave a comment down below if I can help you guys with anything I've done or anything I've skipped over, and I apologize for the lot that I did skip, but this has been a big, big journey and it's coming to close and it's actually getting very stressful almost every day. So thanks for watching guys. Uh, we'll see you back here later on Zach's workshop and uh, kind of a shorter bus video, but happy to make it. Thanks for watching guys.